The Excel match function is what we are going to look at in this video. And in the example here, we are selling Apple products in various stores and our data set is already sorted by the highest revenue. And now we have a drop down list with the products we are selling in here. So these are basically the products. And by the way, if you want to know how to create such a drop down menu, simply click into the video description, there you will find the link. And now when we select one of these products, we want to know which revenue rank does it have. So for example, iPhone 13 is on the one, two, three, four, fifth position in regards to the revenue. So for this, we use the match function, which is equals match. And when we type the opening bracket, the first thing we have to pass is the lookup value. And the lookup value is basically the value that we are searching for. And this is iPhone 13. Then in the next function argument, we have to pass the lookup array. And the lookup array is now basically the column which will contain our lookup value. And since iPhone 13 is only contained in this column here, we will select this column. And for the match type, we simply enter zero since we want to get an exact match. Then we type the closing bracket, hit the enter key. And you can see now that iPhone 13 is on the fifth revenue rank. And when I change the value in this drop down field here, so let's say iPhone SE, then you can see the revenue rank changes to number six. And this is correct since iPhone SE is one below iPhone 13. And by the way, the match function is very often combined with the index function. So this is called the index match function. If you want to know more about it, I will post a link in the video description below. And that's it for this video. If the video helped you, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and also to hit the like button. Thank you very much. And I see you in the next one.